The Wait is a fun mix of humor and mystery with some great recipes for Indian food thrown in. And I hope you enjoy reading it as much as I loved writing it. And I'm honored it's been optioned by the BBC to potentially make into a TV series. So watch this space. So what's this book about? Kamil Rahman is a young detective in the Kolkata police force. He's working boring crimes, seeing a long, dull future ahead of him as he climbs the greasy pole. Then, with one phone call, his fortune changes. He's put in charge of a high-profile murder investigation. A Bollywood superstar has been found battered to death in his luxurious hotel room. Excited by this chance to make his mark, Carmel soon finds out things are not quite as straightforward as they seem. Why does the actor's wife seem unconcerned her husband was having sex before he died? Why has the hotel's CCTV stopped recording just before the crime? Why was the hotel manager's niece kidnapped? As Carmel digs deeper, he finds his own life is in danger. He's beaten up and told to lay off the case and his boss advises him to do the same. But his integrity keeps him going until, after a shootout in a warehouse, he pushes a little too hard and is thrown out of the police force in disgrace. Looking for a new start, Carmel moves to London, where the only job he can get is a waiter at a small restaurant in the East End. He licks his wounds and starts to get close to Anjali, the daughter of the owner of the restaurant, and slowly begins to heal as he settles into his new role. But then he's abruptly confronted by another death. The host of a party he's catering, a millionaire Indian industrialist, is murdered in his swimming pool. Against his will, Carmel's asked to investigate and he and Anjali start to ask questions. There's no death of suspects. The millionaire's new wife, 30 years younger, who stands to inherit everything. His jealous ex-wife and son the Bollywood actress he was flirting with at the party. As the case unfolds, Carmel discovers a strange link to the murder he was working on in Kolkata. To his horror, he discovers he's being targeted again by the man who beat him up over there. Why has the stranger followed him to London? Is Anjali in danger as well? The murder races to a shocking denouement where Carmel and Anjali have to decide between doing what is right and what is expedient. I'm Ajay Chowdhury, writer of The Waiter. I hope you enjoy the book.